ratcheted up the, the defensive intensity tonight? Definitely, yeah. Guys flew around for, for whatever reason against Wisconsin. We were a little indecisive, whether it was flying in there to trap the post and a little little disjointed or disconnected, partly because they played really well. Um, but I thought tonight uh, it started with Reese picking up the ball, being so tenacious on that. But I thought all of our guys did a good job of protecting the paint, but you know, really crowding, especially when Edwards got a, a catch. We talk about air time all the time, and it, it looked that way. Ryan did a great job. Blake, Leon gave us a, a lift. And I've never seen someone miss a free throw as perfect <laughs> as Reese did. That's what we did at the end. That was a perfect miss, and we even got the rebound. We did it on purpose. And he, I said, just don't airball. And he said, I got you. I practice it. So, so I guess Dunn's free throw probably was on purpose, too. Yeah, yeah. The, after, made the first one. We said, missed that second one, point four, So yeah. they couldn't do much. Um, you, I, I think I saw in the last 241, you had five points. Um, did you feel like you were letting the game come to you, and then at the end, you had to kind of push it a little bit further? I mean, a little bit, yeah. You know, as the point guard and leader of the team, is you got to choose your time to be assertive and kind of take over. So. You know, never want to force it, but always want to be, um, you know, looking to attack and look to play. So, um, yeah, those four minutes, you know, we were getting a little stagnant um, on offense. Um, so just decided to go make plays. Um, how about as far as you built up a 10 point lead? It looked like you had control of the, you know, the, the pace of the game. And then they, they hit like I think three threes in a row. Tell me about how that, that kind of changed. Yeah, it was tough. I, I called a bad action out of a timeout, and I put Reese in a tough spot, and the ball, so they hit a three off that. And then I think Ryan thought we thought we thought he had the ball, maybe got fouled. They're kind of, I think, loose ball threes, two of them. Yes. I can't remember the third one. Maybe he just hit a tough one. You know, then we fouled the three points. So we, a couple things that were, were tough to overcome. But, um, but yeah, that's hard when you, you feel like you got a little bit of control, and then you got to reset. And I thought, you know, Reese has improved so much. And some of the plays he made down the stretch off the dribble in the lane, that's, that's high-level stuff. So, you know, you need that. The game comes down to making plays at certain times. And I thought he had a, a, good, a good pace, except for the backdoor pass that he yeah. threw. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, it was just, you know, a game of runs, you know, that's kind of how all games are going to go. So we just, um, I feel like we did a good job. We didn't get too rattled when they, you know, tied the game after being up 10. And we, you know, we just stayed through our offense. So, you know, those games are always good for us. Um, I feel like that's going to help us um, down the season in those close battles. So just about our second one like that already in the first five games. So I feel like that's going to be very helpful. Yeah, for sure. No, for sure. A little less drama, but it was uh, good. <laughs> Any other questions for Coach or Reese? Thank you. Thank you. All right, thank you.